Hello Wobblies, I'm Chris with Wobbly Outer Outdoors and this is an update on some gear we've added to George. George is our Morris Mule trailer. In this video you'll see how the new gear is mounted, a bit about the materials, and also the gear itself. The mounting brackets are made of steel that is painted with Rust-Oleum bed liner spray paint. On top of each bracket are two quick fists. When deciding where on the doors to place the mounting screws, a few things were considered. To keep the doors as easy to open as possible with the added weight, the boards are closer to the hinge side of the door. When the doors are open, it is important that the screws don't press against the fenders. With the boards and brackets in place, the rubber quick fists rest on the fenders. So the recovery boards that Bill got are two pair of x -Bull. They come with a black carrying case if you want to carry them in a carrying case. We'll put a link to the x recovery boards that are on Amazon in the description below so that you can check out pricing and the customer reviews. All the hardware for the brackets was purchased at Tractor Supply or Home Depot. That's where the steel was purchased and we sprayed it with the Rust-Oleum bed liner just like we did some of the parts of George. On top of each bracket is a quick fist, actually a pair of quick fists. There are uh, large ones and then this one holds the axe and so it has a small quick fist as well as a large one. For the shovel, it has two large quick fists. The quick fists are available through Amazon as well and we'll put a link in the description. The axe is an S-Wing Camper's Axe and it was purchased from Home Depot as was the shovel. The plates on either side of the doors are aluminum. The bolts are half inch by six inch. They're tap bolts. 
The only place we could find tap bolts of this size was at Tractor Supply. And the material you see around the aluminum is silicone seal. Thank you for watching and subscribing to Wobbly Otter Outdoors.